Christian, uh, how was the off season? What'd you do? Oh, it's a great off season. Um, I actually went to Italy on my, my honeymoon, uh, extended honeymoon. Um, uh, had my brother's wedding. I uh, went to the, the UW game and uh, had a had a golf trip in, in Arizona. So busy, busy off season, which is good, <laughs> right? Yeah, kind of step away from the sport and. Uh, um, and then, you know, it's just back to work uh, in, in this cold, cold weather. So just the most that you've been able to relax outside of an injury? Uh, did it feel good to, do you feel revived? Right yeah, I feel fresh. Um, it was important for me to be distracted, right? Be distracted all off season because obviously it wasn't a great year for me uh, in particular, uh, just both health wise and, and football wise. and. And so, um, yeah, great to be distracted, great to uh, do, do, do things and enjoy things outside of football. And, um, yeah, I think it was just great for, for my mental health and, you know, for the people around me as well. For several years, you spent January with the national team. What's it like to be with the Sounders for the opening of training camp for the first time in a while? Uh, a little strange, to be honest. <laughs> you know, I haven't been here um, uh, for, for quite some time. Um, you know, for, for the, the fitness tests and all that. So uh, it was it was great for me to, to be here with a lot of the young guys that I don't get to see, um, uh, you know, this early on in the, in the preseason. And, you know, it's about setting the standards and, and creating a good culture and good environment to, to thrive as a team. Not having Nicholas Ladero here anymore, any different vibe or any different feeling starting a year without him on the roster? Well, it's, obviously it's, it's a, a player that's irreplaceable uh, in Sounders history, so it's uh, difficult to start the preseason without his energy and and uh, the, the the goals and assists and quality that, that he that he has um, and, and so somehow we got to replace those goals and assists uh, with, with the guys that we have here and hopefully guys come in uh, but you know I'm excited for what's to come right we, we kind of ended the season in the right way um, you know in the end of the regular season in the right way and um, you know, bitter, bitter end to our, our postseason, but um, replacing those goals are, is going to be really important, um, and, and that's what we're going to try to accomplish uh, this this preseason. You mentioned uh, players potentially coming, and Brian just got done talking about Pedro de la Vega. Have you watched some of his highlight tapes and, and have impressions of his game? I have. I saw all the, all the rumors, and, um, you know, again, he brings a lot of quality, so uh, hopefully uh, we can get him and um, you know, with other players as well. Um, you know, I, we, we added some guys in the back as well. So, um, you know, we just, we, with the, the experience that we lost, um, you know, we, we, we need to replace that. And so, um, you know, uh, uh, fresh, young blood uh, can, can also bring that as well. So uh, we expect a lot from, from guys that come in and then also guys that are already here. I know you, everybody's not here here right now, but do you feel like when you look at it um, on paper or what you saw like in training that you've got adequate um, competition that you can go to to make things happen as you know, in an everyday position? Yeah, absolutely. I think, uh, you yeah, you know, we're, we're always welcoming depth pieces, right? We're, we're always welcoming competition. You know, that was something that, that was, was um, something that we needed last year, right? When I went down, we couldn't really replace that right mid position. Um, you know, and, and then, you know, with, with new who we didn't really have a, a back, a left back, uh, you know, Alex, you know, we, we kind of <laughs> left him out to dry with being the only right back. So, uh, you know, injuries are going to happen, right? That, that's inevitable. And, and we have to, uh, be able to fill those positions. And, uh, I think these young guys, uh, got some, got some, uh, talent, uh, and then we just need to give them experience and, um, you, you'll see their their talent um, show. I know we ask you this basically every year, but do you feel settled position wise? No, <laughs> I, th <laughs> uh, I, th I think you know uh, it'll depend on signings. Again, we talked about the, uh, I feel like we talk about this every year, but it'll, t it'll depend on signings, um, injuries, um, what kind of formation we play. But for now, you know that that right mid spot is kind of the the spot that I envision myself playing this year and. Um, you know, it's something that I, I again need to get better at um, certain phases of the game offensively, uh, and, and you know, if it, if I have to play in the middle, then you know we'll we'll figure out a good pairing. But uh, you know, I'm 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 here to to uh, you know try to. 
be on the field and 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 um, help the team as much as I can. So uh, whatever position that is, you know, I'm ready for that for that challenge. You mentioned the young guys earlier. Are there one or two of them that you're kind of working through with like professionalism or positions on the field, kind of that you you spend a bit more time with? Yeah, I think. Uh, and me in, partic in particular, just being a, a center mid at heart, um, you know, with Obed and Josh and Daddy, those guys kind of gravitating towards them, um, you know, being a little bit more disciplined um, in the midfield uh, and, and not running, you know, out of the midfield. Um, it is going to be really important for them. Uh, but yeah, I, I gravitate kind of towards those center mid, center mid guys because I play more like a center mid anyway on the right, um, and so. Uh, yeah, I think I think Paul will be really important for us this year, um, and then even guys like that are aren't signed, right? Like Kalani, you know, being a, a UW kid, uh, how can I help him? Um, you know, potentially make the team, right? You know, I'm I'm here to, to be a resource as much as uh, compete uh, against these guys, and um, you know, I, I want what's best for them, and I want what's best for the team. So. Whatever, whatever that takes, uh, I'll, I'll take take on that challenge. Christian, un inicio de temporada más. Tu 